All right, welcome back. So we're in walking through the other side of the moon. We're in the subterrain. We already beat one boss, Bag Bagran, Bagran, the one with the snake arms. Um, I keep. I'm trying to get through this one. Um, I was able to beat this one off camera in auto. This time, last time I did it on camera, she wiped me. I don't know. This is not a fun fight. Um, although they weren't a threat in the original game. Um, we'll go ahead and do it. I'm going to beat him one way or another. It's going to happen. Um, but for the moment, go ahead and hit that like button, that subscribe button, and then leave me a comment. And we're going to go move forward. Let's go. Tired of this conversation here. Not again. We're dealing with more than one this time. The enemy knows magic too. We are to face three enemies at once. Well, well, what's waiting for us this time? All right. So you can one-shot these guys. If you can actually pull off a makeshift cannon, you can knock these guys out in one shot. Um, I was unable to do so. So you want to beat Mindy first. Mindy can bring back the others. We'd we'll be a little smart this time. Don't hit her. Hit someone else. Hit something. Thank you. So I'm going to have somebody casting heal stuff so that we don't die. Um, let's be smart about this fight. Okay, so we're going to go and attack you. We're going to go ahead and use an X potion on you. We're going to attack you. So let me go to stop. So Mindy, or... Oh, so Mindy is the one you got to kill quickly. Okay, so the short one is Cindy. She bounces three level spells off of Mindy. Okay, so that's what she does. Um, Mindy's the fat when she attacks. She also revives her sister, so she needs to die first. Good to know, now that I know that. Uh, Sandy is the tall one. She uses uh, spells like Haste, Karaga, and Confuse. She also casts Reflect on the fat one. So we're going to go ahead and change our attack, and we're going to start beating up the, the big sister. Um... Oh, that one's barely alive. So stop. Don't hurt no one. <coughs> okay, so. That was stupid. Man, they sure like using fire on them. So once you take out Cindy, this fight's kind of easy. So let's go ahead and kick all three of them. Let's see what this does. The big problem with them is they attack a lot. I'm actually going to throw a spider um, silk at them. I mean, that might help. I need a Kiraga. It's not a hard fight. I'm, I was making it hard for some reason. I'm not really sure why, but if you if you can actually land a makeshift cannon on them, you can wipe them in one shot. They'll just die. They're not the strongest. Okay, so we'll go ahead and White magic, we'll go ahead and do another Kiraga. Yeah, we know you're reflecting. Are you spying on the neighbors, Charlie? Yes. Is there, anything, no? is there anything they're doing that we need to know about? Does Dad need to go get the gun? I don't have a gun. I'm just joking, guys. 
I do have a baseball bat. And in my arms, that's the equivalent of a gun if I hit you with it. All right, come on now. Bless you, sir. I heard that. Charlie's over there sneezing. Can you? Can you go away? Okay, we're gonna. Oh, that might hurt. Yeah. Do another Kiraga. I guess if I'm, I just was trying to be lazy in this fight, and that's how tired of this game I am, which is why I really should stop playing it, but I need to beat it. I want to beat it. This is for the best. All right, that one's done. Now we can beat the rest. My, my sisters. I mean, that's not going to benefit you, ma'am. That was kind of stupid. Why would you hit us with this? Oh, because we can't cure. Oh. Maybe that's not stupid. It's not going to matter. It's five. Oh, they put us something, 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 or other. Okay. Yay, we beat them. That delta attack, quite an impressive tactic. I never thought about using reflect that way before. Those sisters, my father fought them in the past, too. Yep. The MAGA sisters. My father had his hands full with them, too, once. What's going on here? Why are all these dead enemies coming back to life? That is a question. I don't know if we're going to get an answer. Um... Oh. So now that we can rest here, let's go ahead and rest. What are you here for? Master. I, I, I apologize. Huh? I told you to keep watch of the castle for me. We couldn't just stay there and watch, Master. Not while this moon is advancing ever closer to our homeland. We've come here to defend our honor, my lord. My creaky old body may not be capable of much, but if it'll help stop this moon, I will gladly lay my life on the line. I wanted to contribute to the cause no matter how little it may help in the end. You flatter yourself as if you're somehow become the end of all be all of the Shadow Arts. No. I did not mean that, my masters. Front door open. Not at all, master. I just... My apologies, master. But all the same, I will be relying upon you. Master? I, I thank you for your kind words, Master. I will do whatever it takes, Master. Okay, we quit, quit saying Master. Thank you, my Master. I will do my best to avoid dragging everyone else down. No more Masters. In that case, promise me one thing. Yes. Yes. A promise. What would that be, Master? Survive, no matter what happens. Yes, Master. It is a promise. I will do my best. Yes, Master. You too, Master. Oh my God, that was a lot of Masters. Too many Masters, if you ask me. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and save. All right, let's continue forward, guys. We still got a long way to go. So we're going to go ahead and go down to the new area. Yeah. All right. In the next area. Oh, that's not going to happen. Head down to the next area, down the bridge, right past the door to the silver. Silver hourglass, okay. Follow the path, then inside. Follow the path to a larger room. Grabbing the Genji gloves. Okay, the giant's gloves are better. That's cool. All right, along the way. That was two high wizards. Evil dreamer and a dark grenade. 
That was the same exact thing. Am I going the right way? Hold on. So we go out this way. Should be... Uh, that was another dark grenade and evil dreamer that attacked us from behind because they're punks. Got it. Okay. Got another exit. Okay, so we're going to come this way now. Alright, out on the lower ledge. Go left. Right, that was a bone dragon. Left and up, I assume. Wait. Are you an either? You're an either. Alright, that was a dark grenade, a... Amazon and a high wizard. We're doing all right. Oh, lovely. Okay, before we do this, uh, we're gonna go right for a unicorn horn. Okay, I'm not looking forward to this. Let's see. I wanted to check something. So. Okay. So let's go ahead and get ready for this fight. Okay. It's gonna be another old bad guy that we haven't fought in ever. What's up next? Great, here we go again. I'm in kinda of, I'm kind of on that page. Here he comes. Well, move it. Come on out. Wait. This enemy. He knows my father. I mean, they know both of our fathers, because it's the bosses we fought in the original game. Alright, so we got Dr. Luge and Barnabas. Alright, so let's see what we got. Uh, the doctor likes status attacks like Stephen Poison, while Barnabas just pummels us with strong attacks. Uh, they also target party members. Uh, Luge targets is healed, Barnaby is hit with Blast or Beam. Slow them down, haste yourself, and get to work. All right, so let's start with that. So we're gonna go ahead and throw some spider silk at them. Okay, so if you have Seodor, we do. Um, dang, he already hit me. I didn't even realize he hit me. What the heck? Um, if you have Seodor in your party, buff yourself and protect. Your normal white mage should stick to healing. Uh, his, his attacks really hurt. Uh, once he's gone, Luge is easily slain. So Barnaby is the one you want to kill first. He has 22,000 HP. Luge has 25,000. All right, so we'll just go ahead and work on this. Um, so we're going to go ahead. First off, that hurt. Okay. Should it be that too difficult if we could stay alive? I have an idea. Since he's physical, wow, he just like one hot shot killed her. Okay, now we're gonna. I'm gonna have one do haste and one. Oh well, I can't have one do haste because only one has haste. Okay, no black magic. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and haste you. I'm gonna blink you. All right, we should be good for the moment. So we're going to go ahead and cast Protect on everyone. Okay, so we're going to need magic now. Ah, man, I told you. They're not going to score for a while. It's the Jets and the Raiders. I'm surprised they've got points.
At least we're fighting bosses now. Ah, poison gas. It's how, who's that gonna hit? No one. So let's go ahead and get haste. Ugh. No, my sweet, sweet Barnabas. Oh, that means you're in trouble, bud. Alright, so let's start whooping him. He should fall pretty quickly. I mean, even if he puts one of us to sleep, it doesn't matter. He's gonna die. Yes, that's right. I will show them your power. Uh, but you died. What? Sleep in peace, old man. I can feel it. The regret in his heart is reverberating all over my own. Why? Why is this happening? Father? Oh, come on. This is just horrible. That mechanical doll did nothing wrong. Oh. Oh. Yeah, we're going to rest here, because apparently we're poisoned. <clears throat> I really should have stayed behind. I knew it all along. Don't worry, I'm sure the Elder's fine. That's not all I'm worried about. You know how terrible things are down there. That's why we're here right now. We need to save Cecil and stop this moon. You think the Elder's going to kill over and die just like that? Come on, that's not the Elder I know. Yes, you're right. You're acting kind of weird. You know that? Listen, Palom, you still want to become a sage, right? Huh? What are you bringing that up for all of a sudden? You respect Tella and you want to follow in his footsteps, right? I, well, how am I supposed to know? Not that something, I missed that. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry, you're right. I kind of realized something when I left Mysidia, though. Oh. There, the, there are other people out there with the talent for that title, not just me. You mean Leonora? Yeah, it kills me to admit it, but... Well, that's a rare sight, seeing you compliment someone. I'm not complimenting her, okay? She's my apprentice. <laughs> what? Well, I'm just glad you're still the same old Palome. Ah, forget it. Let's just go help that guy and get this thing over with already. You mean Cecil? Yes, yeah, Cecil, whatever. Now we learned the twin cast bed. It's not it's very strong but takes a long time to charge. Alright though. Right, make sure we're all not poisoned no more. Oopsies. Oopsies what? Interception. By the Raiders? Gosh. Is they it Jimmy tried. G? Oh no. Yeah, what? Is Jimmy G the quarterback? No, it's somebody named O'Connell. They're talking about him being a rookie. Yeah, Jimmy got hurt, that's right. I was pretty sure. All right, so uh, we're going to duck into the room to the left. Should be a high potion. Okay. And then descend the ramp. Should be two chests. We're going to... All right. There's two high wizards. I hate the encounter rate in this game. I've said it a million times. I'll say it a million more. All right, we've got to okay, go down the right ridge. 
The chest has a final outfit. Which is for Kalka and Brina. Um, then go right over the invisible path. Okay. All right, High Wizard, Dark Grenade, and a Amazon. I actually don't think I want to fight him. We're not there yet. He drops, I think he drops a dark, uh, black tail, but I already got one. Seriously. Don't worry, we will be fighting all the dragons that drop stuff. I'm just not there yet. I, I don't want to go into those fights unprepared, and I was unprepared. This game's hard enough without that. Oh, there's an Amazon and a Chimera. Chimera or Chimera Brain. Oh. That should be a Flame Whip. It's not good for anyone in this party. It would be good for, um, like, uh, the Librarian. I can't think of her name right now. Yeah, it is what it is. Okay. Um, da -da -da -da. okay continue on our path. All right, we got a Genji Helm. Dark Grenade and an Evil Dreamer. We're definitely going to go ahead and use a Cottage here. Okay, so on the regular moon, this was a, a Ragnarok, which was amazing. On this one, it's a Blood Lance, which sucks. It has a slightly higher power than the Obelisk, but it gives t negative 10 on all stats, which makes it worthless. All right, we're going to head back to the where we got the final outfit. Shame, that weapon is worthless. There's another Amazon and Chimera Brain. I was a High Wizard and an Amazon. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I have been adding on the bottom of each of my comments or my selections where I write all the stuff, how long the original video is and how many cuts I make. Um, just figured, you know, some of y'all might want to find somebody that some of you might find that cool, so. All right, uh, we're going to go back up. We'll be fighting a lot of dragons off stage. I'm not ready for it. All right, so we're going to go left. All right, so we have another crystal. Okay, so this one's going to be weird from what I'm reading. Oh, these monsters, they're different from the ones before. I sense humans? Is this affection I feel? These enemies, I feel them caring for us like mother and father. No way. I'm, I'm ready for anything. Is it is it the Eidolans? Bahamut and uh, Leviathan? It is. So we're not going to attack them. Please tell Edge. Tell our only son. He must save Eblon. Save our world. Please. That's right. They were they were Edge's parents. Edge, were those your your mom and dad, huh? Such strong parents and so gentle too. I Elder, I hope you're still safe. If my mother and father ever wound up like that, what would I do? His mother was it. Hope my own father is okay. It made everyone think of their parents. That's cute. Oh, oh, we're gonna go there. Okay.
Rydia? Oh, Luca. You alright? Huh? You must have a lot weighing on your mind. Cecil, of course, but also the fates of the Eidolon Kings and Queen. Yes. I know they must be waiting for you right now, Rydia, just as all the other islands did. Thank you, Luca. You seem like you've been enjoying yourself up here on the moon. Does it look that way? Well, I didn't want to bring it up, but there's someone very special to me here. Yeah, everyone knows. Palome, you mean. No, oh, no, no, no. no I'm talking about Master Sid. Mm -hmm. There's so much I still want to learn from that man. Have you talked with Palome at all? Uh, it doesn't matter anymore. Huh? Oh, I don't mean anything more than that. I mean, certainly I had my fair share of jealousy and everything, but now it just doesn't matter that much to me anymore. Luca. It's not like I hate him or anything. I've just got other things I need to worry about right now. Really? Really? We dwarves don't like dwelling over the small things in life, you know? <laughs> That's certainly a very dwarven thing to say. Was that a small joke? Well, how about you grow a little dwarven spirit yourself, then? we still got Cecil to save and also the Eidolon King and his people. Thank you, Luca. Um, hold on. Okay, so go up to the right side. White roll. <coughs> uh, this should go to your white mage immediately. Uh, 10 plus spirit. Okay. So, um, I think I want to end it here. We're, we're getting in it. I mean, we're, we're on the seventh floor of this. We are climbing all the way down. Um, so we got a lot to do. So until next time, adios amigos.